Hey everybody, welcome to the video. In this one, we're going to look at how expenses work in Flipgift's budgeting app. So we'll come back to these charts and things uh, after we've taken a look at the expense sheet. So this is your expense sheet. It has its own dedicated tab, and this is basically to replace your spreadsheet, except this has all the math built in, and it automatically can link to your bank account and to all of our charts and graphs to make it really easy for you to update and interpret your information. So if we look, we'll see I've got some categories in here already. And if you wanted to add a new one, it's really easy. This button will always be sitting for you at the top, add category, and we'll add snacks to our budget. And we come down and we see that's sitting here waiting for us. If we want to add an expense line underneath, we can add Gatorade. Let's say that's going to be $50. And we forecast a date because this feeds into the cash flow chart that helps us understand when we're going to have lots of money and when we might be short on money and need to generate income. And there'll be more on that at the end of this video. So let's say this is August 12th. Add it to the list. And here it is. No problem. You can go in and edit the date anytime you want to. You can edit the value of this. No problem. The name, of course. And if you want to get rid of it, just click the X, confirm to make sure that's what you want to do. And it's gone, no problem. Now, you'll see beside this one, there is no X. And that's because this particular line item has a value, an actual value associated with it. So if we click on this, it'll take us straight to our activity feed where it shows us all of our transactions. And we can see that this is here. In order to make that line item and category deletable, we would just have to either remove this from our budget by deleting it, or you could place it somewhere else. So let's add this to our snacks list. We can create a new line item right here. We'll put Gatorade back in, add the expense. Simply save. And if we come back to our expense sheet, we'll see these changes reflected. We created the line item cat Gatorade. That $300 is now placed under there. And now this can be deleted. You'll see here, it adds up automatically your budgeted forecasted amount. This is what you're expecting to spend. Your actuals, that's how much you've recorded as you go through the season. And your outstanding, which is the difference between the two. And if we come back to our main page here, we can see a quick summary of just the categories, no line items here, the totals of the actual and the outstanding. And we can see our cash flow chart. Now, this budget has no incomes yet, just to demonstrate the point of adding those dates. But this is our $0 line up here. As we hit the dates where the expenses are forecasted, we can see that we go a little bit farther into the red. And as we add income, it'll reduce these or put us into the green uh, throughout the season. And you can see more about that on the income video. And that's expenses in the Flip Your Budget tool.